We got quite some questions on how to test the temperature sensor of a multi and a quattro and what the resistance value is. The answer is, you cannot measure the sensor and see if it's ok. The reason behind it is that the sensor is not a PTC or an NTC or such type, but it has a built-in chip. This chip will, according to the temperature, send out an amount of current, so that the multi and quattro knows what the temperature is. We have chosen for this way of sensing over resistor type sensor, as the wire resistance does then not affect the readout. So there is a more accurate reading of temperature. Because of this also, the wires of the temperature sensor may be shortened or even extended and this will have no effect on the readout. This built-in chip needs power to work of course, and therefore it gets 5V of the temperature sense terminal. This is critical as a chip cannot handle much more voltage as it is designed for. So if you would try testing the resistance with the multimeter, running on 99V battery, the multimeter applies this 9V also on the sensor to get the resistor value. This high testing voltage will permanently damage the chip and the sensor is gone. Besides this, also be careful with the polarity, as a mistake there will also be damage the chip. So, checking if the sensor will work. If a sensor is connected to the unit and absorption and float blinks while connected to mains, the reading is out of range and the sensor can be considered as defective. When there is no direct alarm, but you want to be sure that your sensor is working, you could warm the sensor up with your hand and you could see if the voltage goes down and goes up again when it gets cooler. Another way of testing the sensor is of course to connect it to the temp sense input of a servo or a Venus GX and then you can see the value of the temperature sensor and make sure that it works from there. Small tip, if you have more batteries in your battery bank, choose the middle one to connect your temperature sensor to because most likely that's the warmest of the whole system.